So I'm guessing Tinder is now $500 a month. Hey, bro, whatever it costs to find love. At least you're not going to that 18K alpha book, alpha male boot camp. You heard about the new Tinder Select membership? Oh, Select Is that membership. the $1,000 Tinder membership? That's crazy. You get more options or something? They don't get a chance to swipe left? Membership. Yeah, we talked about this a while ago when it was still an idea. Are they actually doing it? You can only swipe right, Why? right and not left. What does it do again? Why to be part of this group, and it's only going to allow about 1% of its users to gain access. The membership comes with a variety of features, like the ability to direct message people without matching Bruh. first. What's the point Who of that? never want that? Brother, if you're not getting matched, the last thing they're going to want is a message from you begging. Yeah, that's true. Paying $500 a month, uh, $500 a month to cold call like a telemarketer to the women you see on Twitter is the most shameful thing imaginable. Oh my god. <laughs> I like how you shot. I remember when this was an idea a while ago. I can't believe they actually did it. That is baffling. I don't know who's going to buy that. Oh, wow. Yucky. Yeah, those poor souls. Bro swipes right. She it's swipes says Instagram. left and then he At types that point, her. Yeah, That's why you lonely. But it's an even more pathetic Instagram because the women that you're reaching out to are going to know you're paying $500 a month because they swipe. He, he going to be like, that's why you lonely. Bye, bitch. Left on you, that but still hilarious. got a message. So they would connect dots. They'd have neuron activation pieced together that you are a lonely, desperate loser who just spent $500 a month in order to send that desperate message. I mean, they might be like, he got extra so money. Fucked. So let's talk to him. Seen by more users. Tinder select Imagine a condition of going out with a woman, have Tinder select so she knows how much you're making. Because you can spend money on dumb shit like that. A month. The regular subscription at twenty four ninety nine. What's that do? Wait, what? I don't remember that. Also, being seen by more people doesn't help you if you're still not getting matches. Oh, That's I remember true. this. Inspiration for this members only club with Tinder comes from matches J july 2022 acquisition of another high-end dating app the league which costs users up to a thousand dollars per week insane fuck me i forgot about that hold on i need to pull that up again launched in 2015 uh she conceived the app after growing frustrated with her own online dating experience okay so they connect LinkedIn and Facebook, select preferences, and each user is assigned a rep who can answer app-related questions. They swipe right to indicate interest in a potential match or left to pass, and the league shows users only five potential matches per day. In 2016, they released a second version with members now able to organize events and create groups. They also added a feature for women interested in freezing their eggs. What the fuck? That's a lot. Each member receives one ticket to bring a friend, allowing that friend to bypass the application process. Really? Without a ticket, a potential user can sign up for the waiting list. The league scans an applicant's Facebook and LinkedIn profiles to analyze alma maters, degrees, professions, industries, social influence, Damn. neighborhood, and age. Diversity of application applicants is also considered. Currently, there are 420,000 profiles waiting to be selected for inclusion. Paying to become a member allows the user to jump the line. In May 2016, the app began allowing people older than 40 to sign up, and as of August 2016, the median age is 28. 95% straight, 99 have a college degree, and 20, as of 2017, the league claimed it was accepting approximately 10-20% to 20 of users who sign up. Third-party third party data estimates the league has a few hundred thousand users, and users pay nearly $1,000 per week for its top features. Per week? What the fuck are the features? Per week? I didn't even catch per week. I thought it was like a thousand a month. It's just a, it's just an exclusive dating app, which is going to do nothing for you if you're already striking out on like the basics. True. This isn't going to do anything except make you more poor. It's fair enough. There's nothing wrong with using dating apps, but I really think real world socialization is going to be the most effective thing, not only for your own mental health, but in finding a partner with common interests. Because I imagine the places you would go are places that you're interested in. Thus, the people you meet there have some similar interest off rip. Also true. I, I just, I feel like the more isolated people become into these pockets where even dating and even having these personal connections with people is only through a computer or through a phone is just going to leave you even more socially confused. But there's nothing wrong with using them. You can, But I highly recommend going to places. So upgrade your dating life. Members, <laughs> matches and support life. our mission to false, 
to foster equal relationships across the globe. So you get to skip the wait list. You get five daily prospects or 150 potential matches each month. You see if a match has read your message. And you can see your past likes. And that is at minimum $100 per week. Damn. 400 a, a month. And then there's this. You get one extra prospect per day. Yeah. A free power move. What's a power move? What does that mean? Like it's going to spit game for you? It, <laughs> it summons a lot the, for you. the been... holy wizard yeah, to GPT. go in there and try Say and woo the me. women for you? What is a free power move? You get a free rematch and a free undo for $200 per week. That's insane. It's pay to win dating. <laughs> Holy shit. But I mean, pay to lose, really. I was just about to say that you pay this to win but lose. This one is you get another extra daily prospect. So seven. You can see everyone who likes you. You can be paired first at League Live, which I guess is a speed dating service that happens every Sunday, like a fucking game show. And this one's $400 per week. And then here's the VIP, where it says get matches Same. guaranteed. So VIPs get eight daily matches. Wait, so these aren't even prospects anymore? Are they just lying to you? They can't force women to match <laughs> with you. Like, how, is, how does that yeah, work? You they went from prospects to slam dude. dunks? Instant match your batch. So skip the waiting to be... They must have just bot accounts on there for their VIPs in order to fulfill this. Like just completely fake accounts. Hot girls near you. Pretty much, yeah. You can match anyone from your past, and you can be paired with all stars at League Live, which is eligible for eight speed dates on each Sunday for a thousand dollars per week. This is so sad. This is so fucking sad. Mm, oh crazy. My God. I really wonder who'll be spending money on these things. I don't so. think we looked this up last time. I've heard of the league before because when Tinder was kicking this around, they dropped their they name dropped it, but I I don't think we ever looked this up. I feel like I would have remembered all this. This sounds like EA's dating site. <laughs> it actually does. Like, it really does. Where to be oh, surprised. It actually goes deeper. Be beyond the exclusivity, the, features, the feature set is fairly paltry. Select members can direct message another member without matching, but only up to two times per week, and they can't send a super like at the same time. Plus, some recipients can opt out of receiving DMs. Wait, nigga, so I'm paying to DM somebody, but then you're like, yeah, they could just be like, nah, I don't want it. I don't want it. What the hell? And then I can only send it twice a week? That's crazy. That's the ultimate. Let me get your money. So you could just, everyone's going to opt out of that. No one's going to want to be getting fucking messages from goobers that they've already swiped left on. <clears throat> you are actually just going to be sending messages into the void. Yep. You're better off just writing your pickup lines on a note Rolling it up and putting it in a bottle and sending it out at sea and hoping a woman likes it. That would be hilarious. This is such a dumb feature to pay $500 per month on. He's not lying. In addition, select members' profiles will be shown unblurred in the Like You grid in the app for up to seven days. That is rough. Seems more like an escort service. No, at least there you're guaranteed an interaction. Here you're paying $500 a month. For a pipe dream of an interaction that will likely never happen. Damn. Toxic therapy. From I mean, he's not wrong. Nobody's texting back. Let's jump to conclusions. Oh, I did not mean to click on that. He's not wrong. That is crazy, though. Okay, that was the end. But yeah, that's the thing. $400 a week? Bro. Hook up app subscription is surely... Maidenless behavior, <laughs> bro. I was trying to read that because I couldn't see. I was like, "Man, huh? That's crazy. That is maidenless behavior, honestly, bro. You've been damned, bro. Some things like this will never fall to fail to disappoint. I, I'm, I'm just curious who be buying those, bro. Like, who really spends that much money on that? But yeah, like, subscribe. See you guys later. Hope you have a good day or night, and bye.